Yo, what is up YouTube? Welcome back to the Kansas Jayhawks Dynasty. We're here today facing our biggest rivals at Kansas State Wildcats. And this is different than most other years. As you see the Big 12 standings right here, the Kansas Jayhawks are on top of the Big 12 standings as Kansas State is down in 7th. Kansas State still have a pretty good overall record at 6-3. and three. Actually started out Big 12 play at 0-3. They're on a 3-game win streak here going to 3-3 three and three now in the conference. But this is different because Kansas State is trying to knock off Kansas. In real life the past few years, it's been Kansas trying to knock off Kansas State, or they're both just kind of mediocre. But most of the time, it's Kansas trying to battle Kansas State and pulling off the upset. But today, we're in the Bill Snyder Family Stadium, where Kansas State is going to try to knock off our Kansas Jayhawks. And Ryan Shadler is going to make a statement here on the first play, breaking a couple of tackles. He's over 1,000 yards rushing on the year. He has 12 touchdowns. Looking to add to that stat line here today. It's second and two. Ryan Willis is going to scramble right with this one. He's going to throw across his vine. He's going to find Ryan Shadler there for the first down to pick up of eight. Now it's third and 11, though. Ryan Willis is dropping back. He's going to throw it to the outside. He's looking for his receiver. Almost intercepted. It's incomplete. And we're going to have to punt the ball to the Wildcats here. It's going to be Delton and Barnes, this read option duo here today. Barnes has a nice seven-yard rush there on first down. Now second and three, it's Delton on the option. He's going to pitch this one out to Barnes. Barnes is going to be stood up, but he's going to fight his way forward for the first down and gain a five. It's first and ten. Now here's Delton, play action. He's going to drop back, throw his left. He's going to find Lenners, the tight end, who gets shoved out of bounds after a 24-yard pickup. Now first and ten, going to hand this one off to Barnes on the stretch play. He's got a lot of room on the right side. Cuts it back upfield. He's going to pick up 14 yards in the first down. Third and 13, now it's Delton. He's setting up a screen play to McCoy. McCoy has a little bit of room, trying to get him in the field goal range. He's going to be taken out of that 26-yard line. Setting up a 41, 42 yard field goal, but someone jumps at the line. It's the left guard there. False start. That's going to move him back. I actually never, I didn't know how good this kicker was, but I'm fourth and 11, moving it back to about a 47, 48 yard field goal. He kicks that one way short, and those five yards proved to be costly. I'm not quite sure he makes it even with those five yards, as that one reached about halfway through the end zone, but it would have been a lot closer. So the offense is back on the field. It's still a tie game. Ryan Wills just absolutely missed Sternberger, but Patrick comes back for that one and catches that one. So it's second and seven. Going to find Chase Harrell on the screen play here. He's going to pick up six yards. He's going to set up a third and short. Now a new play in the playbook. A QB blast. Getting two guys right, front, right in front of Ryan Wills. And we pick up the short yards there, picking up four. It's 2nd and 10 now. It's Ryan Willis dropping back. He's going to throw this one left. He's going to find Evan Fares. Evan Fares is going to get to the 30-yard line, a 15-yard pickup. 2nd and 10 now. Going to hand this one off to Ryan Shadler up the middle. He's going to pick up a nice gain of 7 yards there. Setting up a 3rd and 3. Hand this one off to Shadler once again. He breaks a tackle, but he's taken down. No gain. It's going to set up a 4th and 3. It's going to be the first play of the second quarter. We're going to go for it. Rolling out. Ryan Willis throwing it right. Very good setup play. Getting Willis out of the pocket. Finding Sternberger there short in the flat. And that's going to be a first down. Now first and 10. Trying to set up a screen play for Shadler. But we're sacked for a loss of 9 yards by Reggie Walker. It's 2nd and 19. Willis out of shotgun. Dropping back. Good pocket. Throws left. He's going to find Harrell. Who's pushed out of bounds at the 1 after a 20 yard pickup. First and goal. Hands it off to Shadler. He gets through the middle. Touchdown. Kansas Jayhawks and we take the lead 7 to nothing here early on in the second quarter no score in the first quarter we dodged the bullet with them missing a field goal after that, they had a pretty good drive, making us punt the ball to him as well. But now it's Delton in the offense, looking to get this thing back on track for the Wildcats. It's second and seven, though. Barnes is going nowhere. He loses one. Mike Thomas with a big tackle there. Sets up a big third and eight. Delton dropping back. Screenplay set up, but he's just going to scramble with it. He's going to be tackled short of the first down. Mike Thomas with a big play. Seven-yard rush. Sets up fourth and inches, and we get the ball back. First and ten. Running some play action. Dumping this one down to Shadler. Shadler's going to pick up five yards. Now, second and five. Going to run a read option. Just give this one to Shadler. Got to protect Ryan Willis as well as we can. It's a four-yard rush. Third and one. Going to drop back and pass. Throws over the middle. He finds Tyler Patrick as the rush came. He picks up 11 yards in the first down. First and ten now. Here comes Harrell in motion. Going to hand this one off to Harrell. We've seen this play a few times. Harrell's going to get through there. He's going to pick up ten yards, and he's tackled just short of a first down. Second and inches. Shadler's going to cut that one back. He's going to pick up the first down and gain a four. 
First and 10, play action. Willis throws this one left. He's going to find Kennedy. Kennedy's going to pick up a nice gain. The fullback getting involved in the passing game, a nine-yard pickup. Second and one, it's Ryan Shadler. He's going to run up the middle for a gain of three. Second and five, going to give this one to Ryan Shadler. He's got some room on the left side. He's going to break this one to the outside, breaks the tackle, gets into the end zone. 12-yard touchdown run, Ryan Shadler, his second of the day, 14th of the season, and only, what are we at, 10 games? Is this our 10th game? I do believe so. He's got 14 rushing touchdowns. You know he's had a big year. Kansas State now trying to get a score before half. Delton's going to scramble on second and six. No QB spy this time. He's going to pick up the first down and more, gain of 15 yards. Second and nine now. Delton's dropping back. He's going to throw over. No, he's going to find Barnes. Barnes is going to break a tackle. Barnes is going to pick up a nice gain of 17 yards. First and 10 now is Delton dropping back. He's throwing right. He finds McCoy in the flats. McCoy breaks the tackle. He picks up seven yards to about the 30. Second and three now Delton dropping back. The blitz is coming. He's hit as he throws. Just gets it out of his hand. It's incomplete. Third and three. This is a big one. Delton dropping back. Going to step up and scramble with it. He's going to pick up the first down. His legs have been the most dangerous part this defense has had to deal with. Passing hasn't even really been there, but here he is scrambling once again on first and 10, getting inside the 10-yard line, a 13-yard rush. First and goal now, Delton dropping back. He's going to look, he's going to step up in the pocket, but this time we get a pass rush, and he's sacked for a loss of one. Second and goal now, bringing the blitz. Delton dropping back, throws this one short to Lenners. Alex Manning's there. Loss of two, third and goal from the 10. 30 seconds to go. Delton stepping up in the pocket, but there's the defense once again. He's sacked again. Two sacks and a big tackle for a loss by Alex Manning. Daniel Wise gets there, and that's going to force them to kick a field goal here on fourth and goal to round out the first half with 3-2. Kick is up, and it is good. It's a 14-3 lead for the Jayhawks here. We really uh, dodged a few bullets there. We dodged the first and goal from about the six-yard line, and we get two sacks and a tackle for a loss by Alex Manning. That only forces them to a field goal, then a missed field goal there in the first quarter. And we take a 14-3 lead heading into the half. I will take that every single time, especially against our rivals, the Kansas State Wildcats. They're going to start with the ball here, though. Trying to make it a one-possession game here early on in the second half. That would go a long way for Kansas State. But we could use a big stop, and it would go a long way for us. But Barnes on second and four is going to break off a nice run here in the Kansas territory, a gain of 21. Now second and 11, Delton's dropping back. He's going to step up in the pocket once again. I'm not quite sure why I haven't learned to get a QB spy as Rob Gray blew him up right there. Third and four. They're going to throw a short to McCoy in the flats, but he's going nowhere. Deontay Ford in on the tackle. And that's a loss of three yards. And we're going to force a punt. No, it's a fake. Smith, the punter, is going to throw this one. Finally throws it left side. He finds Parker, picks up a block, and he picks up the first down. Kansas State comes in this rivalry game and throws out a trick play like that. You've got to be kidding me. First and 10 now, McCoy. He's going to get six yards on the rush there. Now second and four, going to give it to McCoy right back up the middle. He's going to get inside the 10, a gain of nine. First and goal. Delton dropping back, throws over the middle. He's going to find Zuber, and the fake punt pays off. Isaiah Zuber, seven-yard touchdown reception. That's 59 yards and a touchdown now in the day for Delton. And they cut this one to 4, 14 to 10 lead. So the offense needs a big drive here. It's Jay Sternberg on the first catch. He's going to pick up about 4 or 5 yards there. Now second and 6, it's Ryan Willis dropping back. Throws it to Sternberger once it began, who breaks a tackle. Piles through another man to the 40-yard line and 9-yard pickup. It's 2nd and 10. Ryan Willis dropping back. He's going to get hit as he throws, and it just goes incomplete. 3rd and 10. Need to convert here. Willis dropping back. Throws over the middle. He's going to find Sturberger, who stood up, picks up 9. It's 4th and 1 from midfield. What's the decision here? We're going to go for it. Give this one to Shadler. Up the middle, he converts. A 6-yard pickup and a big 1st down. 2nd and 10. Screenplay once again to Chase Harrell. He runs through a man, he picks up seven, sets up a third and three. We're going to run it on third and three. Shadler cuts it back, picks up four first down. First and ten, two fullbacks in the game. One of them is an offensive lineman. Shadler only picking up two, but we're really pounding this clock away. Early and late in the third quarter, but on second and eight, we're going to throw it to Emmanuel Moore, who breaks a tackle, dives into the end zone. 
touchdown Jayhawks. Ryan Willis, 14 of 20 for 153 yards in the passing touchdown. We were pounding on the ground, pounding on the ground. Then we throw it to Emmanuel Moore, breaks a tackle on one-on-one -on -one coverage, takes it to the end zone for the score. We're back up by 11. So Delton in the offense trying to cut the single digits again. Second and nine to play action works well. He finds Zuber to midfield, a 24-yard pickup. Into the fourth quarter now, it's second and six for Delton. He steps up at the pocket. He's going to scramble right with this one. He cuts back. He's going to pick up the first down and some more. A 12-yard pickup to the 34. Now for First and 10, Delton's dropping back. He's looking, he's going to scramble right with this one. Here comes the pressure. He's hitting, he sacked a loss of two. We got to him there. Second and 12 now. Here's McCoy. Stood up by Miller Jr. He's tackled for a loss of loss of one. Third and 12. Delton dropping back, needing a first down here. Here comes the pressure. He throws, but he finds Leonard at the last second into the red zone. A 20-yard completion of first down. Five and a half to go. There's Delton. Throws over the middle. He finds McCoy, who picks up 11 in the first down. Now, now on first and goal, Delton's going to fake this handoff. He's going to scramble with it. He's going to pitch this one to Barnes at the last second. And the triple option works to perfection. We were not prepared for that one. And Kansas State gets into the end zone once again. They're trying to cut it to three now. Delton on the two-point conversion. He's going to get some pressure. He throws short to Lenders, who's met. And he's tackled short of the end zone. So we keep it a five-point lead. So now the offense back on the field needing some points on this drive. So it's going to be a nine-yard gain on first down. Now second and one. It's Ryan Willis dropping back. He's going to be hit as he throws. He gets blown up, but he's all right. Third and one. Willis going to get this one to Shadler. Shadler runs up the middle. He picks up a first down. A big methodical drive here could go a long way. Second and six. There's Sternberger over the middle inside the 40, a 14-yard pickup. First and 10 now, a pump fake by Willis. Sets his feet, throws this one deep. He finds Tyler Patrick. 36 yards. Ryan Willis, the pump fake to the screenplay, sends Tyler Patrick deep. We had two guys going deep. Safety had no idea what to do. 28 to 16. Kansas gets a big play, and they get another. Delton fumbles. Hardy picks up the fumble, and that is a big play by the defense. 321 to go, and we get that kind of play. Ryan Willis trying to just tack it off, but Meeks jumps the route. He picks it off. He's at the 50, the 40, the 30, the 20, 15, 10, 5 end zone. So we go from getting a long touchdown pass of about 35, 40 yards from Ryan Willis, again getting a fumble on the next play to Ryan Willis throwing a costly pick six, and it's a five point game once again. Now with three minutes to play, Sternberger fumbles. Moore picks it up and picks up a bunch of yards. We're actually going to review this one, and Sternberger was clearly down. We don't get the extra yards, but I don't want to see Sternberger fumbling anyway. I'm glad that was reversed. It's second and four. It's 2.15 to play. Some first downs here could go uh, really just end this game, and they're going to start calling timeouts after we pick up first down there. Now it's second and ten. They have one timeout the remaining. We're going to find Tyler Patrick on the right side. He's going to get the first down. There's 2.04 to play. A first down ends this one as we're going to keep running the clock. A one-yard rush there. Now second and nine. A minute 20 to play. Going to hand this one off to Shadler. He's going to cut this one to the right side. He's going to get in the end zone and pad his stats for the third rushing touchdown of the day for Ryan Shadler. Big game he's had so far. Finds the end zone once again. And it's now a 12-point lead. And this game's all but over. Just going to look for Kansas State to go drive down this field and see if they can get any points on the board. It's third and one. They're going to set up a screenplay to Barnes here. Look at Gray. Look at that speed coming down the sideline. Catching up to the halfback Barnes who had a lot of open room there. It's third and nine. Delton's going to drop back. He's going to find Barnes on the screenplay once again. He's met and he's taken down. It's going to be fourth and inches from about the 45-yard line of the Kansas Jayhawks. Delton's dropping back. He's hit. And he is sacked. A nice way to end the game here today. 35-23 as we're going to kneel out the clock here. He's hit and sack. Coker gets in there with a nice move. 35-23 win against our rivals, the Kansas State Wildcats. Never an easy win. We had this big play. I was actually worried because we get this big play, then we get a fumble, but then the pick six, I was like, oh, no. Just please don't tell me this momentum's going to shift and they're going to stop and then their, de their offense comes out and scores. But our defense was very good today. Ryan Willis pick six was really our only costly play on offense other than that uh, first possession we didn't get much going but I'll take that though we played phenomenal as a team and we're going to stay atop the Big 12 Conference with I believe one maybe two I think two games left 
week 14 and 15, I think. We have Baylor and someone else, can't quite remember. But you will see in the next episode as Ryan Shadler had a nice day, 96 yards and three touchdowns, had a few catches as well. We get the 35-23 to win against Kansas State. Hopefully we move higher and higher up in the top 25, see if we can get ourselves into a better bowl game. Ryan Willis with a nice day. But that is all for today's episode. If you did enjoy, make sure you hit the like button, and I'll bring the next one to you guys as soon as possible. Hope you guys did enjoy, and as always, I'm out. Peace.